been selected and sworn as the jury to try the case of the state of Florida versus Nicholas Cruz. The jury has been seated. After months of selection, the people who will determine whether the Parkland shooter will be sentenced to death or life in prison are in place. The jury was sworn in today, and they're in for months of testimony in the sentencing trial. CBS 4's Ted Scouten was in court and joins us with the latest. Ted? Lauren and Elliot, the headline today is that we now finally have a jury seated after months of jury selection. Also today, the judge announced a new trial date. It took three months to get here in a pool of 1,800 people. Finally, a jury has been sworn in for the penalty phase trial of the Parkland shooter. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, you have been selected and sworn as the jury to try the case of the state of Florida versus Nicholas Cruz. The confessed killer already entered guilty pleas to 17 counts of murder and 17 counts of attempted murder for the massacre at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School four years ago. So we are objecting uh, to the panel. Finding the jury of seven men, five women, and ten alternates was not easy. Just as the jury was nearly selected, the defense objected, focusing on three members of the panel and their answers regarding the death penalty. The judge allowed them to strike one of the alternates, then asked the shooter if he understood. Mr. Cruz, have you had the opportunity to participate in the jury selection process with your attorneys? Uh, I don't know what's going on. Uh, I trust my attorneys. What they say. Well, you don't know that we're in jury selection? I thought, I thought we were done. Right, but the jury selection process, when the people come in and they tell us our na their names and where they work and so on and so forth, you were here for that, correct? Yeah. So you did participate in listening to what they said and the selection process, correct? Uh, yes. The judge also set a timetable saying the trial would start July 18th. That's when attorneys said they were concerned about getting some of their potential witnesses in place for pretrial hearings. The judge shut it down, saying they can choose from 10 days before the trial begins. And normal trials take a couple of weeks. If you can't get your experts, both your experts here, within a couple of week period of time, then why did you hire them in the first place? Now, attorneys will be back in court on Tuesday. For the next couple of weeks, you're going to have some pretrial hearings, including one that will determine if swastikas owned by the Parkland shooter can be admitted. Once again, this trial gets underway on July 18th. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scout, CBS 4 News.